happy late Valentine's Day, you lovely people. Since it's still February, whether you're in a relationship or single, let us indulge ourselves in chocolate that have been kindly offered to be on sale for us. And well, for me, I won't remember how much I suck at starting relationships or socializing in general and having common sense, which is kind of this video. So this guy, I'm gonna call him Cup. I first met him when I was a sophomore, well, just by seeing him around the hallway, and he was super tall, and I don't know, he just caught my eye, and I was just like, oh, I wanna talk to him one day. So I just saw him here and there, and just like, oh, it's that guy. Oh, it's that guy. Oh, it's that guy. <laughs> Until one generic anime love romance base day. But not really. Man, it's raining a lot. Good thing I brought my umbrella, though. Oh man, it's raining outside. Oh, uh, I have an umbrella. Uh, do you wanna... Hmm? Yeah. Cold tail, cold tail! It's, it's that blue boy. Oh, what, what, what is he doing here? What is he doing here? What? Nah, it's okay. Don't worry. Uh, are you sure? Yeah, thank you though. That's very thoughtful of you. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Wanna walk together? Okay! And I'm flabbergasted! Flabber! Flabber! What, how, how do you. Flabbergaster! Okay, like, I get it. He wouldn't want to be rude and share this small umbrella, but he wouldn't be rude even if he said yes. But the darn rain! It's really coming down. Who would not offer in this kind of situation? Since he refused, we literally just walked together. Even though I had my lovely umbrella keeping me physically dry, Cup is getting drenched in the rain, and while I got drenched with guilt. And while we were waiting for our moms to pick us up because we don't have school buses, I had to go eventually, but the rain kept pouring even harder until it literally felt like bricks falling from the sky. I offered my umbrella once more since my mom was already here to pick me up, but he kept refusing. So, you know what I did? Alright, so this tall boy won't listen to shit I say, so I'm a... Uh... Wait, what? But it's okay. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh, what's going on? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! I didn't sleep well that night. The next day came, and he found me around the hallway, and he gave back my umbrella and thanked me. And that was the last time I talked to him. Until the end of the school year! I don't even remember that well. He suddenly talked to me in the middle of the hallway, and I sat at his lunch table, and asked if I wanted to walk home with him. And my reaction towards that was like... Oh! Oh! So, you're saying, huh? wait, I get to walk home with someone, and then I get to become friends with them? Wait, no. That's, <gasps> well, that's, like, so that's not that's so how it works, though. You left brain, you you're right brain, no! I guess he had other plans. So, we reached a place where we had to part, and we talked a little more, and then all of a sudden... Oh my god, what do I even say? Hey, huh? um, can I just say something? Uh, yeah, you've been saying things this whole time, so... Well, I... um... you see... <laughs> Imagine he just says, oh, I like you, and I will literally throw myself into a... I like you. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa? I did not expect that at all. Like, dude, we literally met only once and talked like, I don't know, two times? W what do you like about me in that short time? Maybe the umbrella incident, but is that really enough to do something like that? I don't know. There's this thing people say, love at first sight, but I just don't get it. <laughs> I'm the type of person who doesn't crush on just anyone. I'm not saying I have the most highest standards of all times or the most lowest standards of all time. I'm saying that it takes time for me to get to know someone. I talk to them and I get to know them a few more months later and I really develop a crush. Though sometimes I feel like I have bad taste in men. <laughs> Though I understand celebrity crushes, you know. You know. <laughs> Anyways, back to it. My thought process was going, oh my god, D do I really need to throw myself off a even finished thinking before he said it. 
It's fine. Uh, but wait, maybe he means it in like a friend way? I mean, we just met. Uh, I'll guess I'll reply. I'm just gonna say before I say the answer, if I had known what I said was going to cause this much of a problem, then I would have rethought about what I said and be like, oh, that's not what he meant. I should change it. But instead, I said this. Oh, well, I kind of like you. I think you're cool and all. Really? Oh, crap. He looks too happy. Maybe what he said was a confession. I, I honestly have no idea still. I know I'm at fault for leading him on, which wasn't my plan. I just didn't know how to correct myself, and I just kind of assumed that he could be assuming I meant it in a friendly way. But I mostly had no access to common sense, and my general brain at that point just threw itself out of my head. But let me tell you when he said all this. During the week of my final exams, I'm already having a ton of stress. I don't need someone to give me heart seizures while I'm trying to study. And since he's a senior, he doesn't need to take it. He's free from taking final exams. God damn it, you. Somehow, throughout that whole week of torture, I managed to pass all of my exams with mostly satisfying grades. Mostly. He asked me when I finished my exams and if we could meet up, and I said sure, because freaking me can't say no, and I gotta say, he couldn't have asked me at the worst time possible. So after your finals, do you want to meet up? Okay, I'll see you then. Okay, I can already hear in the comments, Ew, there's a part two! You have to make this split it? Ew! Okay, listen, um, February. I said February in the beginning of the video, and I was like, oh my god, I need this out by February. I thought about making it into, like, one, but then February, so I was like, um, I need this out now. So, here you go, and yeah. And I also want to thank TJ2s for voicing the strange, strange part. I'm sorry he got, like, such a strange part. But he's my first collab, and I'm really grateful that he, like, came, so... And voiced it. So, you should you should check him out! Check him out! Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. Like, he's, like, one of the person who made me more comfortable on YouTube. And I was like, oh! <gasps> oh! <laughs> so, yeah. And, uh, go check him out! If you don't, then, uh, I will be very, 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 very sad. Although, I'm pretty sure you all know him. <laughs> okay. Well, see you, but later. Okay, bye! Love your faces, and mwah! Okay! <laughs>